so you want to know how to make a banger easy intro that keeps the audience engaged and tells the audience more about what you do in your channel you want an intro that explains but entertains the audience at the same time and keeps them interested in what's coming up in the video well in this video i'll be showing you the top five best free intro makers for beginners nice What's happening, folks? Any things here? Yes. Um, I've been doing videos. Video with with uh, you can see by the channel name and the channel branding and everything. Why it was very confusing. Meaning, um, D Rose means the rose, but D is an Afrikaans word meaning the rose. <laughs> Many of you did not know that, and honestly, I I was it was just the face, the rose face. Well, I'm over it now. Like, I, I really don't have that much interest in roses to the point where I have to base my life around roses. I had hoodies with roses, t-shirts, socks. It, it was crazy. So why did I choose this name? Well, NBM are my initials. The OGs don't know what they are. And then I wanted NBM Tech, but it was taken. So I decided to go with NBM, NBM Techniques because um, I'm a young technique. <laughs> Otherwise, that's really why I chose NBM. I chose NBM because it's my name, who I am, and tech, you know, because I do tech. So I was like, why not? You know, it's it's not it's not the best name, but it, it'll do, you know, um, it's something. And the, 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 the reason really was because people really mispronounced D-Rose. It was said by many as Deros, which was really annoying well it was just something that i got used to but at some point it was really annoying so i just decided you know and screw these people <laughs> um i just decided not nah, so i've placed these intro makers from the most complicated to the easiest and simple apps or websites you can use to make your intros well i only did this because so you can watch to the end because i know many of you do not have the knowledge or the skill to make most of these high graphic um, number five we have um an app known as blender blender is a free open source 3d creation tool or again an intro maker it's really simple once you have learned it and it's not as complicated as something like um adobe after effects or something like that it's it looks complicated, not, not gonna lie, it looks crazy. But it's a really good beginner software. I personally tried it and I personally did not even make anything. But this is an example of what you could have actually made with this app once you have mastered. It takes a few months and once you have mastered, you will not regret the time you've learned. But there's another way of getting to know this app better by using templates. You can easily go on Google and search Blender template, templates. You can use these templates by installing them on your, on your PC, opening them in Blender and then replacing where it says name with your name or logo or YouTuber name. At number four, we have a website known as Pantoid. This is a very popular well-known intro maker it's specifically known for its short clip videos it's very easy to use um much much easier to use actually compared to the previous one you don't have to download it it's a website it's free to use with no watermarks so even though it's free you get some websites or even um download downloadable software that require you to well they don't require you they forcefully put a watermark there because it's free but not really they'll self promote using your video you understand so out so panzo outputs up to 4k footage all you have to do is go on google or go down to the link in the description open panzoid um choose from the hundreds of templates that are available you can even search what exactly you're looking for that fits your youtube channel once you've done that you can go ahead and open clip go down to um a few settings or just a few settings change the name to your youtube channel and you're done you know you could remove the music and add your own music but that's for another video that i'll make detailing how exactly you can do these steps 
but otherwise you can go ahead and export and your intro maker will be banger these are this is an example of what you can make using pen and number three we have an editing software known as Fujimura. i've mentioned this editing software as one of the best beginner editing softwares in my previous video you can check out the video right here it'll give you the best editing softwares and you definitely need an editing software when you're using intro make it's a downloadable editing software with a free trial although i have the premium um, package so all you have to do is browse through the thousands of templates the hundreds of free templates on their website download and upload them to filmora and then edit your music edit your youtube name and you're done you, you can edit something like this with filmora or you can just learn the app and make something unique and more creative you know like what i've done with well they're not as creative but they are unique because no one else can do what i've done without them seeing what i've done for the last two i've chosen the easiest way to make an intro but yet still being a bit a bit unique but very creative this is another website called place it place it is similar to pens or it has the similar look even but it's very different because it has animation to it you know you can download you don't you don't download the software because it's on a website but it's different because it has animation to it so it's free to use but it has a watermark i like it because it's not as big you know the watermark is there but it's not as big you can do something about it so it doesn't really show but you can add your own music you can choose a clip you can you can browse through the templates that are there already choose a clip that you would like edit your own music if you want to and then you're done very easy nothing too complicated about that. and what's great about place it is if you have a logo you can actually use a logo and not just text in your video which is why i've placed it so high in the list because it offers animation and it offers support for your own logo so that you don't have to compromise when you, or you don't have to start looking for other softwares to make a logo by the way if you're enjoying the video a sub to the channel would be immaculate finally the easiest way to make a youtube intro with the least hustle and the most laziest way is using an app well as using a website called motivetools.info it's not even an intro maker it's honestly a website where you can find thousands of thousands of videos in loops and all you have to do is download the free video from that um website upload it to your editing software literally just write your name on top of it write your youtube channel on top of it and then add music in the background or you can just leave it and you're done that's it it doesn't even need you to know how to edit it just needs you to know how to copy and paste speaking of video editing softwares don't forget to check out my video on the top five best beginners editing softwares and for pros as well just in case you want to switch to a new video editing software anyways guys that's the end of the video thank you for watching this has been nbm techniques. techniques i've been blessing catch you in the next one peace